In this video, we'll balance the net ionic equation BaClO3 2 plus Na3PO4. This is barium chlorate and sodium phosphate. So the first thing we need to do is balance the molecular equation. And this is the molecular equation here. Probably easiest to do, we have three bariums here and just one here. Let's put a three in front of the barium chlorate. Now we have three times the two. So we have six of these chlorate ions and only one here. Let's put a six in front of the sodium chlorate. That gives us six chlorates, six sodiums. So we need a two here. Sodiums are balanced, two phosphates, and we have two phosphates here. That's the balanced molecular equation. Now we need to write the state for each substance, and that looks like this. Compounds with the chlorate ion here, they're very soluble. Compounds with sodium, also very soluble. But phosphates in general are insoluble, and barium phosphate, that's insoluble. So it's going to be a solid. When these substances here react, it just falls to the bottom of the test tube. That's our precipitate. So these are the states. Now we split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. And note that we don't split solids apart in ionic equations. So that'll look like this. So now we can cross out the spectator ions. They're on both sides of our complete ionic equation. In the reactants, I see six of these chlorate ions right here and in the products. So these are spectator ions. They haven't changed, but just cross them out. Six sodium ions in the reactants and in the products, spectator ions. What's left, that's the net ionic equation for barium chlorate and sodium phosphate. I'll clean it up and write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for barium chlorate and sodium phosphate. You'll note charge is conserved. We have three times two plus, that's six plus, two times three minus, that's six minus. So this all adds up to zero over here, neutral net charge of zero. Charge is conserved, and if you count the atoms up, they're balanced as well. This is Dr. B with the balanced net ionic equation for BaClO32 plus Na3PO4. Thanks for watching.